and this is our new automation surface. It can do four or eight cameras and it takes advantage of the built-in profile moves within each of our cameras. If you want to use it simply, you can just touch the screen and the camera will move smoothly to that shot. And in that case, that's shot nine on camera one. If you want to adjust that shot, you can adjust the time it took, the ramps, and the, move, the time the zoom started and stopped. You can also create sequences of moves using the sequence button. And here I've set up a little news trailer sequence so we can look at all the events in that news trailer. And here they are. Camera one, go to the opening shot. Camera two, go to the opening shot. Sit around and wait for a trigger. So we're waiting for the show to start. When the show starts, pause for four seconds. Then camera one will zoom to a close-up. Really, really simple if you want to create a new event, just push create event, it slots it in at the end, you can edit and create, here we go.